So there it is folks, what everyone thinks of for Spain. Empty white beach, Mediterranean, and big yellow thing in the sky. This is our first glimpses, and it can only get better from here on in. A lot west below, got a blue flag. But what's nice is you've got it in Braille. Well, you've got that in Braille? No, you play on there. Uh, I was being impressive. It's really nice. It's really nice. Player, gentlemen, Stop it. Stop what? I'm eating. But what are we eating? Potato brothers. Spicy chips. Very nice. Very Spanish. Very Spanish. One of your favourite Spanish tapas? I do like these. Do you prefer chips with salt and vinegar on? I just said, notice all the vinegar. Yeah, I know. It's like a mirror. They're quite nice though, because they're hollowed out, aren't they? Empty plate. Two minutes later. Three. Yeah. <laughs> they've all gone. Look, it wasn't just me eating them, you ate them as well. <laughs> What's up next? I hope we've ordered correctly. We've got toast with bacon and chicken and dates on it. What's going to be with don't know. It'll be fine. Wait for the next chapter. <laughs> toast, bacon, anchovies, and dates. That looks interesting, doesn't it? What was it? It's a taste explosion in your mouth. Oh. How much of it's left? Going. No. No other water spray. It goes. Whoa, it's gone over again. Yeah, failed. Again. <laughs> oh no, 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 we're up, we're up, we're up. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Go, 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 go. I can do walking. I can do walking and talking. Can you do walking and talking? I can walk and talk. I'm not holding the camera though. What are you talking about? 
absolutely nothing. We are walking up the road towards Mercadona because we can't find the consom anywhere. I can, I can find loads of signs. <laughs> there are signs everywhere. Oh look, there's a sign over there. We still can't find the thing. And we are trying to make a video about our holiday. We are. Trying. Very, trying. very, very badly. We are. Oh, if you got on the bus, you might go past the console. Because <laughs> even that one there says it's on Playa Blanca. So we know where it is, we're just going to have to find Playa Blanca. We can't find it, we just can't find it. And why do we want to find the console? They do good pies. They do good pies. And that is the only reason. <laughs> they do good pies. Unfortunately for them, they also do very English stuff, but they do good they pies. Do, they do good pies. So, massively busy underground market. Hopefully somewhere we'll find Michelle. Hopefully somewhere she'll have bought lots of vegetables. We're always ambitious, but you never can tell. There she is. Broccoli. Yeah. He's got peppers, he's got tomatoes on the end. Right. Yeah, they're two bits for a euro. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Success, we have. Follow me, follow me, and squiggly Pimentos. Pimentos. All for under five euros. Big bag. Well, actually, three euros and 65 cents. <laughs> So we've been to the market, found the food market, and we have got garlic for 90 cents. <laughs> What's wrong with my mushrooms? I'm not sure what the mushrooms going to be like. They look beautiful. They've got to be good. They were like eight pound a kilo. Pimentos. He'll be nice tonight then. Michelle is shirt shopping. Obviously need new shirts. Mm. 
They're not bad for 15 euros. It's quite nicely cut for 15 euros, to be fair. What size would you need there? Because they go in four or five. Oh, do they? Oh, okay. It could be more, more of a technical. So we've cut up the, the mushrooms. We're still not amazingly sure what they are, but they look beautiful. They've got a beautiful orange colour, a bit of a green colour. Um, Googling them said that we should wash them off, but not wash them, so do it with cloth. We've added in some ordinary mushrooms, which in this country are called seps. So we've got lots of nice mushrooms. In this dish, we've got onions, garlic, pimento peppers, this is just the base, this is just going to taste gorgeous. And then for the rest of the stew, we've got potatoes. So everyone's going to be in this stew. There's just a bit of stock, a bit of spices, a bit of herbs, and it's going to taste great. I'm sure. We'll let you know later. If not, we don't like that website anymore. It's a large archaeological dig on the on the Costa Blanca. There you go. Right on the edge of the sea. Beautiful views all round. And this is the tomb. First bit on the way all around the site. The remains of a burial structure can be seen here. The grave walls were li lined with stones shaping a masonry cyst. In the Bronze Age. 3,000 years ago. Isn't that amazing that they're concrete then? Perfect. Lovely view. Worth the two euros for the view. I am fearing there's a lot of concrete up here though. So this was a pub. So 5,000 years ago there's there was a village here of other people integrated into a tribal social organisation. The remains of this ground floor plan, part of the of the household, have been particularly preserved from that settlement. The uh, settlement was born in the 5th century BC, but it went through a significant urban development and transformation halfway through the 4th century, as a result of which it came to be structured by two longitudinal streets. So it would have been part of the street. Do you don't like your picture taken? No. Why not? Very true. Next issue. Smile then. If you smile, I can press go and then we're gone. <laughs> 